versus Mr. E and the Buzz. Mm. So we got Mr. E and the Buzz repping that tri-state. You already know. True. Uh, so definitely East Coast representatives. And then we got Ally and Zach. And, you know, Ally being from Canada. Yeah. Zach being from Louisiana, right? Yeah. So, I mean, not a regional team there, but I I'm still glad to see them team up here. And are we going to see the bail? That's the question for me. And Yeah, the bail. Yes, there. dang. That, those glasses are clean. Oh, they are extra clean, man. I need a pair. Man. I'm So, again, it's awesome to see the bail. Kind of this character. Yeah, I super character is super a place, and I love it because you know what? It allows it to be like you know what? You guys can say what you want. I generally love this character, and a lot of them are just very, very solid. Man. Yeah, they're players. good players. Yeah, they're good players. Period. They can say whatever they want. These guys are talented. They yes. do their thing, man. Really, really awesome. But anyways, uh, Zach is going to go with his fail. Of course, we rock with an ally, and so nice. One of the lot of nice things that's really great about this situation is. Snake can play the neutral for you. You can go yes. and kind of circumvent a lot of those holes you usually see in Bale's gameplay in terms of singles. So that's going to be really exciting to see. Yeah, and I really want to see, like, Bale still has really strong moves. Tipper back air is actually very, very strong. Um, yeah. Definitely one of her main kill options now. Yeah. And if you have a teammate that can set you up into it, and I, I also feel like Bale can also now kind of feel like that support role in team because Absolutely. she still has decent damage output, but... She's just not as strong as she was in Smash 4. Yeah. And, and already, also, you just see yeah. the stocks flying. Easy catch. And one of the nice things, too, is Bayo and Bayonetta Smashes are now so much more viable because they are not, they're no longer just low, uh, low, low priority. priority. Yeah. And so that's very, very important. So in a space where you want to have big hitboxes, when you see scramble situations, she can throw that out there and really clear the stage. Right. And I'm, I'm glad uh, it was kind of like a give and take. You know, obviously, um, they, they took away from which time in some of her combo games, but they, they gave her those smash attack options, which yeah. is really nice. And we see, I, I just really like how Zach is setting up to the ledge, and he's not upping to the ledge, he's double jumping, which is really, really smart. Yeah. Absolutely. And so, of course, I love Zach one for that potential one for two frame. Also, too, as we all know, uh, when you see the actual Dolphin Slash come out of uh, Mark or Lucina, it doesn't necessarily auto snap. You have to space that perfectly. Yes. So if you do your space just a little bit, that dare will hit, and that will be a stock. And yeah, right now, Blue Team had so much control, but I feel like Red Team is clawing their way back. It seems like they've had center stage control for quite some time now. Okay, here's the upbeat from Zach. Okay, yeah. all the way. Okay. Yep. Wow. Yeah, and that's a dive kick. That Dang. is a dive kick confirmed. Oh, yes. Welcome back, free patch. I love that. Yeah. I love seeing those. I just love seeing the Bayo still trying to make it work. But even even after the nerfs, they're they're still in there. They're trying to make it work. But solid up smash coming out from the buzz yeah. here. Oh, and I actually yeah. like that going for the Dolphin Slash after that uh, explosive flame that came out of. The buzz, really, really good stuff. Oh, but there goes Red Team's tank. The buzz was stock tanking, but now Ally still has two stocks, but the explosive flame, not going to be enough. Yeah. Oh, man, Red Red Team putting on the pressure. I like the shield break coming out from Mr. E as well. But oh. there, oh, no. Oh. Player one defeated. Yeah, I love how it's on the stage. <laughs> Player one defeated. <laughs> oh, no, and Mr. E is not going to have fun here. The up tilt not going to connect. Oh, yeah, yeah. Definitely one of Bale's, like, main combo starters now, yeah. I feel like. True. Very true. Okay, the witch time here. Ally trying to get back on a stage. He's going to go to the ledge and taking turns. I like yep, it. Absolutely. I like that. Mr. E just trying to close out this Ally stock, but Ally is just not cracking. This man's defense is so good, and he's just amazing in teams. We've seen him team in Smash 4 and Brawl. Just an amazing team player, and he has his snake back. Exactly. So now he's going to be doing big things. A lot of times he had trouble because he knew he a great team. He had to play Mario. You know, but this is his character. This is his oh, wait a minute. Oh, dang, I wanted oh, him to end up? his soul. Oh, yeah, Not going to lie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait. Oh, dang. Are we okay. playing with our food right now? Yeah, what is that? <laughs> okay, that going off stage here. Ally going to cover for him. Oh, Bye. And, and you yep. see that pressure and to cover Zach. But, oh, dang, the fist. Yes. <laughs> yes. You're going to te- I mean, and it's just, that was a great kill option. But it left him vulnerable, and Zach was able to back up his partner, and that's what you have to do in doubles. You have to yep. be there for your partner. You got to back him up in all those sticky situations, man. Yes, absolutely. It's like rolling with the homie, man. Yeah, man, you have to. You got to stick it's, up it's, for him. Yeah, it's not just about rolling with them when good times had, because everyone loves the combo, man. Oh, yeah, People love yeah, to man. press buttons. They can say whatever they I, want, but when you can, you want to press those buttons. Oh, yes. Right? Let me press that button, exactly. that big green button. Exactly, but it takes a lot of higher skill, and it takes a a paradigm shift to be like, okay, how can I maneuver around my teammate? How can I 
basically go ahead and take care of them and yes. support them and allow extra pressure just by being in a certain position. It's going to be very, very important, especially in this game, too, where you do have on certain moves that balloon knockback, and it's going to be make it exponentially harder for someone to actually get a conversion off of. So yes. you really, that position is going to be very, very important. And this, uh, especially right now in this early meta that we're seeing in doubles. So, to my understanding, in teams you can run through your teammate, but you can't run through your opponent, right? Yes. Yeah. So, so that is a mechanic they recently add to ultimate. Very, very meta-changing mechanic for sure. I, I really love it. So, but in teams you can run through your teammate, but you can't run through your opponent. So that's right. definitely something to note. You know, if if someone's in front and you want to back them up, you can run right through your teammate and you know throw out that hitbox and help them out. Absolutely. All right. So right now. Red team trying to fight for that center stage. Ally trying to stop the yard, man. That move is so good. Oh, it's da very, very I just good. love how down air is like a really good move. In Brawl, yeah. it was like low key troll, but like yep. in this in this game, it's oh, so it good. Is punished. Yep. And sets up certain tech chase situations after that, like 20% that you take. It's like Snake is literally just walking on you. Yep. <laughs> and you gotta hold, the yard, that. Dude. <laughs> you gotta hold that. You gotta hold that. Save the last dance, dude. He's oh, too good. And Red team in so much control. Ally gonna go high here, but Miss um, uh, Captain Zach gonna get knocked back off both. Blue team, can they make it back? The double jump. Ooh, oh, yeah, maybe he's gonna get that up smash after all. And, and Captain Zach was the one that had to get sacrificed in that situation. Exactly. It, it sucked, but like, it's just they were both by the ledge. One of them was gonna get hit, but Ally gonna clean that sock right up with the up tilt. Yeah, good stuff. Yeah, someone had to go, and that's just kind of the pressure and the presence of mind that we saw really from the buzz. Really yeah. great uh, ledge trapping there, and they just continued to threaten those guys. And when you're off stage, both of you guys, someone's eventually gonna go. Yeah, and I like Mystery. It's it's very interesting. The buzz is definitely known for his amazing defensive play. Not saying he can't be offensive at all, but right yeah. now he's going in. Oh, he's and Mr. E is playing the backup. He's playing the stock tank, yeah. and we see him right behind the buzz just waiting like oh you're gonna go over the buzz you gotta deal with me you're yep. gonna go high you gotta deal with me and he's playing that role so well and he's still got all three of those stops yeah when i see them playing right now nothing is free and that's what i love Ooh, i the love the shield, pressure, yes the on pressure. that top platform yeah. blue team i when you when you are just so synergetic and you pressure the shield like accordingly yes. and especially with the shield set in this game like sometimes you just can't escape you there's nowhere to go yeah uh, we're locking the shield down absolutely Okay, blue team all control. We got ledge trapping happening on both sides. The grab, the down throw. Wow, the witch time, but it ends up hitting ally there. Yeah, of course. But yeah, I just love that coverage. And that's another great thing. Like, Snake is such a great tank slash support. You can set up the down throw tech chases with two people exactly. as well. So strong. That four tilt finally going to wipe out Mystery's first stock. Yeah, and one of the great things, too, is because, again, even though Snake at later percent is going to get frame advantage, your teammate's just standing there. You space yourself right. That's an easy up smash every single time. Exactly. So there's just a lot of stuff you can do in that situation to further the damage just right out of down throw. So I really love the setup of the scene from these guys. Yeah, and right now, ooh, ooh that's beautiful. edge hard. Yes, and edge guarding, uh, teleporting. Oh, dang! But yeah, he'll slide yeah, into yeah, that invincibility. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> I, I think he didn't think he was gonna get down quick yeah. enough. So the buzz gonna clean out that sock. But man, amazing edge guard from Captain Zack, and we just see, oh man, and that reaction on the normal getup. Mister E gonna close that out. Stocks flying left and right here. Yeah, man, who said double too slow? Oh, it's definitely not slow. Oh, we we, we speed not. running out here. Absolutely. And the great thing about it too is you can see at the higher level, you see people who are more accustomed to the balloon knockback on particular moves. Yes. They're able to even combo from those. And that's the beautiful thing. Ooh, an ally setting up the Nikita to abuse that teleport recovery. He's yes. like, I know you gotta come to this ledge. You ain't teleporting nowhere else. Nope, nowhere else. So great edge guard from coming from Ally, and that's a move that's definitely gotten uh Crazy amounts of buff. Uh, not too good in Brawl, but now such a powerful edge guarding tool. Yeah, it is an amazing tool in this game. And coupled with the fact that you do have only one air dodge unless you uh, get hit again, it's, it is rough. It is, you got to hold that computer. Oh, two. Oh, man. For one, Zach, no, yeah. Zach almost got two for one combo. Man. Yeah. All right, right there. That's a good deal. Ooh, and I like Zach overshooting the upbeat into the double side B there. Really yeah. great stuff. <laughs> and Zach is just so hard to catch right now. Absolutely. I love how he just was like, excuse me, Ally. Yo, I got business to attend to. Like, he had a flight to catch. <laughs> <laughs> he just side B across the stage. I like that. All right, so a little bit more doable situation. The down smash not going to connect here. Wow, great smash DI coming out from the buzz, though. Up air not going to follow up. Here comes the forward air, man. The buzz has to hold this down. It's possible. They're both at kill percent. Maybe not so much Snake, but if you can take out Zach, then yes, you can make this do oh, a doable one. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, the back air gonna connect on Zach, but he's gonna hold no, on. No, here. no, wait, hold on. Hold oh on. wow, he runs right into the side beat. The oh, buzz no. making that obstacle, and now oh, we have a 1v1, Bam. Yeah. yeah, 
Yeah, mono on mono. Yeah, I, I felt like Zach was in a position where maybe he wanted to play more defense, but you know, when your teammate goes for the defensive stance, you kind of have to cover and go in for him. Exactly. We yeah, have great Zach explosive throw. flame. Oh, the Nikita. Oh, beautiful high recovery coming out from the buzz here. Yeah, that back throw has a pretty good amount of frame advantage. Obviously, Snake cannot get there. Uh, but, however, that Nikita really just about edge. Ooh, play. dang, man. Ooh. Ally be smoking. Yep. He, like, fast through on. all those platforms, try to get that forward smash, setting up these grenades here. I'm very surprised we didn't see a... Uh, uh, Ooh! <laughs> dang, when your life flashes before your eyes, yeah. man. <laughs> that explosive flame was so good. Man, an ally playing very aggressive. Definitely one of the more aggressive snakes I've seen. Absolutely. Okay, what's the ledge trap here? The Nair. Oh, okay. Oh, no, not living. just yet. Grenades. Oh, but he catches directional air oh, dodge. Yeah, and yep. you are not going to be able to detect that one, ladies and gentlemen. And that is something they added to the game as well. If you get wow. hit by a strong enough knockback and you're at high enough percent for the knockback to be strong enough, yes. you just can't tech. You see that red splash right there? Yep. Untechable. Untechable, Which man. I like low-key don't like, but I low-key like. Because it's like, you're not going to have like characters live at like 250, like yeah. teching the stage over and over. Yeah. It I makes it so like being aggressive and going aggressive for stage spikes is actually a viable exactly. option. Exactly. And it's, you know, something usually you see at a very high percent. So again, it's something where, okay, I feel like at that point, you know what? It's sick that you can, like, if you're trying to recover and you get hit. And you right. You get hit again and you tech. Right. At a certain point, someone's got it though. And that's Someone, what happens there. That's the way I somebody's see it. Somebody's got, got Hey, man, we got it. Yeah. We, you can tech Sheik Bouncing Fish. Yeah. Cool. Cool. You're fucked. But, <laughs> we, we know you can yeah, tech. Yeah, we know you can do that. But, <laughs> but somebody's you gotta got to go. go. Someone's got to go. And one of the cool things, too, as well, is because it's knockback um, specific, if you are not DI correctly, you can yes. actually see trigger ya. the untackable <laughs> situation. Though. Exactly. So you always got to be aware of that. Sometimes you can't uh, try to DI up. You know, into the stage because what you'll do is you'll actually bolster the knockback because you're holding up as you normally would in the eye and then you have to get in an untechnical situation. Exactly. So we're getting into game number three here. And this is best of three. This is the last game we'll be seeing against these two players here yeah. going back and or four players going back and forth here. Okay, hey, Zach gonna get something started here. Ooh, and picks up with the heel side, but another and Zach is just not letting the buzz play. He, he's not even like necessarily comboing, but he's picking up all these resets. Yeah. Okay, now the buzz. Okay, both both uh, teams kind of going back to their side, but Ally going to stomp right on in. Very aggressive, like I said. Okay, I, I like the directional air dodge. Ally went for there. He's just like, hey, man, I don't want to interrupt. And the beefy up tilt. Oh, oh wow. Dang, wow. Uh, that was interesting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Down throw off to the ledge. I, yeah. I've actually never seen that, so it looks like you can just go right into directional air dodge. Very exactly. interesting there. But, but I like that too because you can kind of force them off stage with that down exactly. there. Exactly, and that's a situation where uh, in tandem with the directional air dodge, that should be easy to up to. Exactly. So that should be kind of guaranteed or you're just off stage. Yep, and just very, very interesting stuff. The four till dang, that almost killed at like 112. Yeah. Yikes. Snake is strong and he hits very hard. And oh, oh man, I was like, maybe he'll leave the explosive play, but dang, that uh, he was cooking. Oh, well, he definitely cooking. Okay, so right now, man, Captain Zach, with the three stocks, the buzz, red team stock tank going down now. Yep, Blue job. team up an entire stock here. Captain Zach doing a really good job just playing very evasive and just being evasive and moving around the map so exactly. quickly. Yeah, very Ooh, dang. Ooh, uh, dang, move down, down. Yep. <laughs> now I want you down there, dog. Yeah. <laughs> Man. Really, I, and I like that everyone's starting to DI Politana Nair up. You guys, please, DI that move upward. Because nobody likes getting Nair to Nair. Exactly. I mean, thank goodness they actually took it down the hit uh, hit lag. It's uh, funny because like when I was watching a match, I'm like, all right, here's the, the Nair train. Like, yep. 10 seconds later, you're like, yep, still getting Big Nair. <laughs> thank you, 2.0. Yeah. Oh, the shield oh, break. The shield break and boom, and the fist to end it out. And dang, man, right now, Captain Zach is trying to seal out these stocks. Absolutely. And like you said, those smash attacks did get buffed. Yeah. So definitely a lot more viable and ally gonna close out another stock red team with a very sizable lead here or blue team with a very sizable lead we'll see if red team can bring it back okay here's the uh which swiss combo not gonna connect there yeah not gonna be enough damage here and i feel like uh Bayo generally is more abk focused nowadays like which was is still good but it yeah. definitely seems like you get more consistent follows off of the abk no i absolutely agree especially uh the eye is relatively easy now oh so the like, interruption really when i go for an abk yeah and Ally just interrupting that sword dance as well. The parry into the dash attack. Now, man, Red Time is or Red Team is just getting ledge trapped so hard. Ally gonna catch that landing and 
Mr. E almost gonna lose his stock right there. Okay, here's the back air. Man, red team just bleeding so hard right now. There's the rapid jab. Ally gonna... Wow, it was big enough to actually hit Ally there. Wow, and the buzz with the up air to close it out. <laughs> and Whoa, both of red team just what uh, the heck happened to their life? Yeah, I think they did definitely got Rashido right there. Oh yeah.